Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, whatever time of day it is for you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alicia and this is Heart and Hand Creations and Events. Today on this channel, I am making a wreath for my daughter. She asked me to make her a um, fall wreath and a, you know, two seasonal wreaths, a winter and a fall. So right now I'm in the middle of making a fall wreath, I mean, um, not a fall wreath, <laughs> uh, um, winter wreath for her. And this is where I've gotten so far. And I'm sorry for not picking you guys up in the beginning of making this, but I got distracted. And before I knew it, I was, I'm darn near halfway through. So I'm just going to show you what I have so far and I'm going to finish it up with you. This is, it's not really that much. This is what I have so far. Um, I'm using hot glue. I have some wire cutters. I also have the wire. I have a couple of pieces already um, tied, uh, not tied, but cut off a couple of pieces to use. And um, you see my decorations, the pieces. This is one of the stars pieces that I saw in Dollar Tree. Um, I have this wired on this is wired on um uh, this right here was a whole plume and i just cut it these berries here with the frost on them you see they have the little glitter thing going on there to look like frost and i also put lights on it this battery pack for the lights all right so let me finish this up and i'm just because I only have five of each. Oh, this is another frosted. I say it's like a, a glitter. Champagne gold glitter. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put these in between the red and around the red. So, And this is how it goes. Since I'm working down this end, I'm going to bring this over a little bit more. piece straighten it out a little bit I'm going to put this in the middle since there's one little skinny piece I'm going to stick this right here in the middle Also have a couple of pieces that are fuller so these two pieces would are what I'll be using to finish off this top portion Let's see what I'm gonna stick at mm, got a spot right there Get that battery packed out of my way And I put, I should have put the, um, uh, this on last. Because it's kind of restricting my movement here. What I do is I'm sticking the ends through the branch. Oh, there we go. All right, I got it. But I want it to be in the right position. There we go. And for this end right here, these two will go in between. So I'm going to put these in place and I'll be right back. 
All right, this is what I have. And actually, this could be held in any way, any direction you would like. At this point, it could be held at any position. Let me bring this up a little bit more. It could put it this way. You can put it on the side this way. You can put it on the side this way or from the top. What I have planned on doing is putting the word peace on here. So if I put the word peace on, then that just eliminates the options for how to hang it. So I was thinking to put it like this on the bottom. Hang this this way and put the word peace on the bottom. I think that's a good one. Oh. Wait a minute. Let me bring this up. And this will go like that. Yeah, so I think um, I may put it right here. I'm thinking about it still. I don't know. And if I was going to put it maybe this way. thinking about that too mm -hmm, guys uh, I'm gonna sit on it for a second once I figure out how I'm gonna put it on then I'll let you guys back in on it and see how it turns out all right guys this is what I decided to do with it and this is with the lights on I told you it was uh, some lights on here it's a green light uh, let me turn it off so you can tell. Here we go. This is what it looks like without the light. Now I'll turn the light back on. There we go. And this is for my daughter. It doesn't have a whole lot, but it says a lot. It definitely says winter. Peaceful winter. Okay, guys. Um, Well, I guess I'll tell you how I put the the piece on. The word piece, as I told you, I was had some wire already cut up. And that's what I used it for. And I put it on the back here. And I just twisted it in place. Cut the stem and pushed it in between the branches. And for this one, the same thing. I strung it through because the, the wire was a little shorter than this. the wire was for this side. So. And that's how I have it on. And the lights are just strung around. This hangs. I'm not sure what to do with that. But... Um, my daughter's pretty crafty. She'll figure it out. I don't know. I guess I could put it on here like this. And it would hide it like that. For when she puts it on her door. Plus, it would be easy access to get to it. I mean, it often on switches right there. So. But that's it, guys. If you like this little short video, little snippet, let me know. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe, like, share, comment below. Let me know what you think about this little special one here, door wreath. And, um, oh, and thank you. I have a new subscriber. Uh, thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button. And for those of you who are liking it, thank you so much. Thank you for the views. Thank you for watching. And, um, yep. So, I want you all to have a great and blessed evening, morning, afternoon. Again, like I said, whatever time of the day it is for you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.